Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Arthi Raghavan um, and today we are going to be talking about how to maintain any of our oral appliances. A lot of us um, wear different types of oral appliances. Some of us um, have dentures um, that are removable. Um, by oral appliance I mean anything that comes in and out of your mouth. For example, a night guard. Um, or an Invisalign tray, um, or any of the similar trays. It could be a denture that comes in and out. It could be a sleep appliance that goes in and out. So one of the um, commonly asked questions is about how to take care of these appliances. Let me actually start with why it is important to take care of these appliances. So oral appliances are typically made of um, medical grade acrylic. Um, also known as PMMA or polymethyl methacrylate. So this material is an acrylic material. So there are definitely, regardless of the medical grade strength, um, there are definitely minute pores. Um, and the care of these appliances can actually make or break it in terms of the longevity of the appliance or the cleanliness of the appliance. Um, both actually so how clean we keep it is very very critical and the process that we follow to take care of it is equally critical because if we don't do that then it increases the porosity of the appliance over time um, and actually can lead to more bacterial buildup which at the end of the day is very unhealthy and unhygienic when we put it in our mouth because it all goes into our body um, it can also determine how long your appliance lasts. Obviously, the more porous the appliance gets, the poorer the upkeep of the appliance obviously shortens the lifespan of the appliance. So one of the first things that um, I would say to anybody who wears an oral appliance is that if it's an appliance like the Invisalign or the Night Guard, do not wear it when um, you are eating or drinking anything, particularly anything acidic like coffee, um, pop, soda, lemonade, all of that, because that can actually shorten the lifespan of the appliance. If it can come off, like your Invisalign trace can come off as you are eating or drinking anything, it is required that you take it off um, when you eat or drink anything, and then um, brush your teeth, clean your mouth, clean the appliance again before putting it back on. That's point number one. So let's go to how we clean the appliance. Um, one of the most efficient ways to clean the appliance is with lukewarm water um, in a cup or a bowl um, using a type of um, effervescent cleaner or denture cleaner. Um, several of these are available on the market. Um, uh, if you go to Invisalign's uh, website, they sell their own. You can get these off of Amazon. Um, you know, you can basically pick any of those um, good effervescent um, denture cleaners. Um, you can, if it's a tablet, you can break it in half or put the entire tablet in depending upon the number of trays that you're cleaning. So um, take half of the tablet, break it up, put it into the uh, cup with warm water, soak your appliance for about 15 minutes, and at the end of it, gently use um, the toothbrush to brush away both inside and outside. Um, make sure that there's no debris or plaque um, or food material that's left in there. Rinse it, and then it's ready to wear. Um, one of the key mistakes that I've seen that a lot of patients make is that they brush their appliances with the toothpaste. The toothpaste naturally contains abrasives because it's meant to abrade and take away all the buildup that's there on our teeth. This abrasive over time can cause porosities and like I said, the porosities will lead to more gunk and buildup and can shorten the lifespan um, of your appliance. Um, so. These are some of the things that we need uh, for cleaning, a little bowl, some warm water, um, denture cleaner, and a toothbrush. Um, I hope that that video is useful for all of you um, to help maintain your oral appliances and to get the best um, hygiene and longevity out of your oral appliances. 
you guys have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask us in the comments and we'll do our best to answer those. Have a good rest of your day.